Welcome back and uh, good morning. I couldn't leave it alone this night. Uh, I started a lot on this motor. And again, like uh, Mr. Newman uh, was telling, this thing can run off solar without the need of any battery. As you see, I have a nice big solar panel here. And when I stand in front of it, you will hear the motor going down. And now it will go up. This motor is running pure on solar energy. And this is my good morning view. And this motor is running on it with no problem at all. I'm not even doing the capacitor charge trick or whatever. Just disconnect for a moment here because wires are all messed up. Make it a little bit longer because I don't want to pull cables here. Have to stir it up a bit because yeah, it's only one solar panel. Newman uh, used uh, more solar panels, but yeah, his machine was a bit bigger. But as you can see, it has a nice speed. Just turning, put a gear on it, and uh, you can do something with it. The motor can do work. This is a um, solar panel capacity. Um, it's upside down actually. Uh, I will read it. It's a uh, 22 volt uh, non load 5 watt solar panel. So again, this is only a uh, well, full solar. It's, uh, it's capable of delivering 400. 50 milliamps. Well, I still have the scope connected to it, so we can start that up. And still visible are peaks. You can really see that um, the motor is not really using or fast a lot, you know, it's like only this little bit. But these spikes is again the the back spikes that you get. And they also are more higher than uh than the actual uh input. So Again, another successful experiment. Hundred percent on solar. This motor have to adjust it sometimes a little bit. So that he makes this perfect round, you know. And um, I can try to connect one of my favorite little toys, the neon bulb. These things never lie. <laughs> if there is some kind of an energy here, 
that is higher than the battery and I am Bob will show that and if it does not really really super flashy flashy and in one of my later experiments I try to um, put this uh, start uh, capacitors that uh, are used in uh, neon tubes even though uh, if I put this one on this one too and I will like, put them across the coil you can see this kind of pattern and in this case the motor will slow down So with solar pa uh, power it's uh, not a solution, but when I was running onto the batteries, when I put this one on, it shows that a, re a really a lot of speed it went up totally. Well, thank you for watching, and till next time.